What does it take to be a great youth pastor? Well, my answer is always the same. Xbox 360, a copy of Rock Band, book deal, and uh, there's something else. Um, our ministry is called Flame. And it's based on some verse in the Bible about fire. It's like God's my trainer, and he's stretching my spiritual muscles as well as my physical muscles. You know, we want to see our kids on fire for God. Becky told us so much about you. <sighs> All good, I hope. <laughs> God wants to raise up a generation of flamers. I mean, in the middle of this godless culture, we want to drive a stake in the heart of it. Sometimes you just need a break, you know? I mean, we want our kids burning at the stake. Ignatius is like the biggest name in student ministry. I believe that in the middle of this culture where sexual morals are out there, sex is wrong. But for me and my smoking hot wife, it is so right. And our kids are struggling with gender issues. God wants to raise up a generation of flamers. And you probably want to spend some time with the students. Why would I want to do that? I want to see our students stand up in their classrooms, in their hallways, and unashamedly proclaim, I'm a flamer. I'm proud. Now in this movie, there's the character, the Joker. Let me ask you a question. If he gets up there and starts preaching, I don't know what to these kids and messing with their brains, I won't have a problem going up there and dragging us behind off the stage and throwing it out the door. I don't care who he is. If any of you wanted to take a pencil and shove it in someone's brain, in the Bible, it says that we judge a teacher by his fruit. It doesn't say what to do if the teacher is a fruit. I mean, to think that there are kids that don't even know about the Flame website is, wow. But, um, yeah, I want to see them fired up, you know, and engulfed in flames. They are going to be smoldering. I'm going to burn them! <laughs> if you just...